Hello everyone. This is my first attempt at an unboxing. Got a brand new camera, Panasonic GH5. Super excited to get it. I did buy it from eBay from a private seller. So I'm doing this video pretty much just to open it in front of a camera just in case. I have heard uh, cases recently where people are buying things on eBay and Amazon even, even uh, purchased through Amazon, fulfilled by Amazon, where the box comes and it's filled with rocks. So uh, luckily, um, Amazon and eBay both have fantastic customer service for buyers and sellers, so full protection there. I'm not really worried about anything, but this is just uh, a precautionary measure. So let me get a knife. Okay, trusty knife. See, uh, everything went pretty well on the uh, shipping. It was one day late for as far as expected delivery time, but nothing to complain about. Still give a five star review if everything's in order. So let's just check it out here. Pook. Oh, she went um, to the store. What do you need, babe? Okay. Now, this video is actually being filmed on my old Panasonic GH4, so uh, pardon the autofocus. I did have lots of lighting in here. We're just going to try the autofocus. It's with the Sigma 18-35 to and a uh, uh, Metabone Speed Booster. I believe it's the S version, the old one, uh, 0 .7, 0 0.71. So, anyways. Oh, yeah. Oh, a lot smaller than I thought. DC-GH5. It's in here. Let's see. What, I don't think it came with anything else, but... The seller had uh, 27 good reviews. 27 sales, 27 good reviews, so it was a pretty safe bet. All Panasonic things uh, marked new... Um, this was uh, well under the suggested retail cost, so hopefully, I mean, we'll see. She's advertised it as uh, new, as in uh, unopened. This does have some, it has obviously been opened before. Not, not super brand new, but we'll take a look here. Okay, yeah. Good on there. Some manuals, yeah, have been opened. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, camera body. Got a uh, charger. Oh, came with battery. Came with a. Uh, oh, for the charger. And a. Uh, oh. A Panasonic uh, neck strap. And that is all she came with. Put that to the side. <clears throat> I've been using the GH4 for uh, about three years. Love it. And uh, just decided it was time to get something new. Ah, <sighs> camera. All right. So. Looks about the same as far as uh, how it's laid out. Is I mean, I've watched a million reviews. Um, I'm sure if anybody's watching this, then uh, you've also seen a million reviews. The uh, wheel doesn't free turn, I guess. That's something I didn't know about. Oh, it has a lock, just like, okay, so. Like I can't, I don't believe that my GH4 did. Maybe I just never pushed it, but everything looks the same, actually. There's a little paint tab. I don't know what that is, but movie. Okay, let's pop a battery in here. And... Good. Got a charged battery over here. Okay. 
There's those dual card slots they talk about. Sensor is right in your face. It's been a long time since I've seen my GH4 uh, without the speed booster on it, so um, yeah. But I'm gonna turn the GH4 off and uh, pop my, uh, so I don't have any native Panasonic lenses, unfortunately. I would love to have a Panasonic 12 to 35 2.8, uh, one or two, I don't care. If anybody feels like donating, that'd be awesome, but I don't expect it, but uh, it's my next, uh, next thing I wanna go for. Uh, so good on the uh, quality, image quality that I can tell online that I would almost be willing to sell my speed booster and my, uh, well, at least be willing to sell the Sigma uh, 18 to 35 because that 12 to 35 looks awesome. It would be nice to keep the Metabone speed booster just in case uh, I want to use my other Canon lenses, but yeah. Okay, so.